Parents are afraid to let their children go outside. They're afraid of Lyme disease. They're afraid of mosquitoes. They're afraid of predators. They're afraid of splinters. They're afraid of everything. And so children have been in this world of plastic. There's been a lot of research indicating that children are actually nature deprived. Somebody even coined the term nature deficit disorder. There are many, many studies that have been done about the value of being outside, about the value of just having time to be alone, to be, um, to be away from the hubbub, to be away from all the intense energy that might happen elsewhere, just to have time to think and to explore and to be creative. Children need time to be able to just make it up themselves and be creative. The Jewish Early Childhood Education Conference in Washington, D.C. is an opportunity for our community, um, all of our early childhood programs, to come together for one day of professional development. When we had this particular conference, the topic was Tov Pateva, and our goal was to help people understand the importance of bringing children out into nature and bringing nature into the classroom. There were many, many different um, workshops on these topics. Um, anything from, you know, how to help parents manage their anxiety about letting children explore nature to, you know, what kinds of things would be great for kids and what kinds of things to do with children in nature. We also looked at the philosophical educational aspect of it. Why is nature important to children? What are children missing by not being out in nature? What we asked our schools to do after the conference was to reflect on what they learned at the conference and to begin to think about how nature is brought to the children in their schools. That started our staff off on some inquiry and some thought and some discussion about what children really need to grow, what's good for children. Then came our idea to, to try to build an outdoor environment. I grew up around here. I grew up on a cul-de-sac in Fairfax County and we hung out of the cul-de-sac. We went outside after school and uh, my mom said just come home for dinner and all the different ages of kids just ran outside. We roamed the neighborhood. So this in some ways for me is a throwback to that where they can just go outside and play. We say that we need to take care of our earth and that children need to be the stewards of our earth and in order to do that you have to be out in nature to to learn it to understand it to ingest it almost and make it a part of you if we're going to ask them to take care of it